Welcome back to Good Morning Vale. Joining us now is Todd Van Fleet. He's here with the Lions Arts Festival, Lions Head Art Festival that's going on. And he's gonna tell us a little bit more about what we're gonna find today. So describe for us what the atmosphere is like. Uh, the art show? It's yeah. It's pretty laid back, you know, there's people walking around, checking out, it's a lot of good art. There's a lot of talented artists there. Um, you know, this is my first art show, so it's kind of new, for, well, it is new for me. Yeah. So it's pretty exciting. Though. And you're a photographer, fine art photographer. Yes. And you've decided, where did you start? Because I know now that you have mainly bicycles as your, yeah. what you're photographing. Well, I started taking pictures when I was like eight years old. And then, uh, you know, in junior high, I got into art classes, kind of nominated myself a high school newspaper photographer and yearbook and then got a scholarship to art school and then just stayed with graphics art and photography ever since then and then I uh, took many pictures and um, a lot of landscape stuff but you know everybody's doing landscape pictures you can see them everywhere and yeah. the minute I started putting these old bikes I just have this thing for vintage bikes and right. cruisers and you know riding cruisers with my friends and um, so I started putting the vintage bikes into the shots mm -hmm. and started getting a lot more attention and it just brings a new dynamic to the photos and it just kind of got a lot of attention from there. Yeah, and it's amazing. You can see all these great shots. I and mean, what, what inspired you to do this? Did you just find that bike next to that? Or do you actually put these bikes in each That thing? one that, that was one, just obviously. up there, I found that old crusty bike. And the older and the crustier the bikes, the better for me. Because it just, the bikes have so much personality. And you wonder what stories and where these bikes have been and who's ridden them and, and things like that. And so I just literally try to capture the personalities of the bikes. And then I just take them all over Colorado and Wyoming and try and put them in the best scenario that I think uh, where they belong, so to speak. Well, and who's buying these? Who is, are they cyclists generally or um, anyone? Anyone, really. People that, I mean, I haven't met anybody that doesn't like a bicycle. <laughs> Especially so, a cruiser bicycle. Yeah, a cruiser bike. And then a lot of people will see the bikes and go, oh my God, I had one of those when I was a kid. Or, mm -hmm. um, and they don't even have to be necessarily bicycle enthusiasts, just people that have appreciation for what a bicycle is. and. Um, you know, just getting on a bike and riding is like feeling like a kid again, you know, that's yeah. like, who doesn't want that feeling? And then when you see the pictures of the bikes, it's just brings a lot of people brings memories for them. Oh, that's I great. Love, I love to do that. Yeah. And how big are these photographs? How big are they? I print them anywhere from eight by 12 up to like great big 40 by 60. And if somebody wants to go bigger, I'll certainly figure out a way to print them larger. And are you using a, what kind of camera are you using? I use a Canon digital SLR. It's like okay. top of the line, shoot like extreme high resolution so I can produce an image pretty much as large like on a billboard as wow. large as anybody would really want it to go and that's sort of the movement with digital photography that gives you so much room to, um to yeah play. you know the cameras that are out nowadays are I, this is probably going to spark a controversy but I think just as good as some of the film cameras out yeah. there and um it just, I'll be honest with you, it makes it a lot easier for post-production sure. and um, makes my life a lot easier to when use digital. you can digital. maybe get more creative, too, with digital. It's interesting because yeah. certain things you would never think about with this plane, you can add in. A lot of that is, yeah. is true, too. I stick kind of to, I grew up with film. You okay. know, I knew how to shoot film. I still know how to shoot film. And I think that was key to when the digital transition came around, that knowing that ahead of time. So you find the purity of film still? Are you trying to stick to those those values of? Well, yeah, really you know, you photo? still a lot of the thought process goes into the same as I'm building a photo as it would have before. Hmm. It's just uh, just a different tool, you know, more up to date it's just technology, yeah. and you know, just trying to stay up with the times and um, just the method I prefer to use. And are you traveling around with these artists? Are the I know the Thunderbird artists travel basically in a pack around the nation. You know, are you doing that with this group? You know, I don't know, because like I said, this is my first arts festival. Okay. So I will be up in Telluride in August for that show, and then we're going to see how these two go, and hopefully I'll start doing a lot more next year. But I like to travel, like load up the family, and we go. Yeah. I've got my two daughters and my wife, and actually my in-laws are up here with me Great. Um, this weekend. That's good. And yeah. now, has Fat Tire Brewery, just a question, <laughs> have they called you the Fat Tire Actually, New Belgium somebody Brewery? from New Belgium found out about me, and uh, they bought like three really large prints for me that are up in some of the offices in the brewery in Fort Collins. Uh, I think so. They're a great company, and they've been really good to me. Okay. All right. Well, Todd, nice to meet you. And where's your booth at today? What's the number? Um, 
it's booth 19, I booth believe. Booth 19, okay. Yeah. All right. You can't miss it. I've got it all. The bike that's in that sand picture, mm -hmm. I kind of fixed it up and put some oversized baskets on it. And so that's my print rack. And I've got that sitting out in the front when it's not raining. Okay. So if you see the old cruiser bike, just come find me and say hi. And you should come down and check it okay, out. Okay, I will. It's booth 19. <laughs> I'm not going to miss it. So head out to Lion's Head today. It goes on from 10 until 4. It's the Arts Festival. And there's going to be a lot of great artists, including Todd. So we'll be right back.